maybe things are starting to look up for me after all. Fred, hey! hey. I'm so glad you- Awkward. Is there any proper way to play off waving to the wrong person? Woo! <laughs> Woo! Ah! <laughs> That is a clip from the award-winning <laughs> online show. It's called The Misadventures of Awkward Black Girl. Its creator and star is Issa Rae. Now, she started making shows for YouTube as a student at Stanford University. Her episodes have more than 20 million views, and her shows have more than 200,000 subscribers. That success landed Issa Rae a national TV show on HBO. Her new show, Insecure, premieres this weekend. We sat down with her at the HBO offices to find out what makes her so awkward and why that speaks to so many people. I've heard from many young women, black women in particular, that you are telling their story. Is that the best compliment you could hear? A hundred percent. And I'm, I'm just like, where were y'all when I needed friends in middle school? Because <laughs> we could have gone through this together. Sorry. I'm not looking for a relationship right now. Sad day. He did not sad face you. I will slap you right. The other thing that they like is that it's an authentic telling of black female friendship. Black women are like the best thing to happen in my life. But what do you think most people think about black female friendship? That we friendship? fight all the time. And because of like the, the rise of reality shows, which, you know, we talked about, I'm guilty of watching mm -hmm. and I love Me watching. Me too. But like, I'm like, that's not, I don't know that life. Like my friends and I don't throw chairs at each other. The worst we do is like curse each other out. I, and that's always still out of love. And tell your dad that black women aren't bitter. They're just tired of being expected to settle for less. Her outfit settle for less. <laughs> An insecure, Issa struggles to fit in, just as she did growing up in Potomac, Maryland, and Los Angeles. In Potomac, I had a lot of friends of different ethnicities. You know, I had a lot of white friends, and so the way I spoke was just I spoke properly, and that was considered talking white. And so when I moved to LA, there was just like, you're not black. You talk hella white. Like, this is not, who are you? And I was like, I don't know who, I thought I was black. <laughs> you know. Issa, you are black. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Jay and I'm awkward and black. When did you know start? though that awkward black girl ago, that you had it. something here? Honestly, it was after the first episode and I like was nervous and anxious about putting that out. Like, I uploaded it early in the morning, and just went to sleep. I was just like, I don't even want to know. And then when I woke up, it had spread. And then I started getting random emails that week from people who were like, this is my story, this is, I didn't know what I was, but now I can come out the awkward closet. And <laughs> I was like, I gotta keep going with this. It's interesting that it's called Awkward Black Girl, because I sit here looking at you, and I think, ain't nothing awkward about you, Issa Rae. <sighs> it's, you're, you don't, I, You can I say, you don't know it. me, Gail. <laughs> yeah. You don't know my life, Gail. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, but it is, it's, it's just within me. Like, it will never go anywhere. Like, I've always related to just feeling uncomfortable and out of place. Oh my God, you're awkward. I know. I get you. Awkward black girl this got the attention of HBO who greenlit Insecure. But we're here. Okay, let's have fun tonight. The show follows two friends working their way through romance, career, and everyday life in Los Angeles. Are you concerned that people think it's only relatable to black people or black women? No, I mean, I'm concerned with the people who are open-minded enough to watch and who feel like, oh, I want to know more about this. You said, I want to talk. We are not about to be the black couple fighting in Rite Aid. You've been compared to Curb Your Enthusiasm. Which is an honor, because I love Larry David's work. Oh, I'm not, I'm not Jewish. Oh, you're not. Did you think I was Jewish? <gasps> yes, I did. Because of Bird. <laughs> yes, because of because Bird. Because of Bird. That show, there were a lot of Jewish references, and you know, I would either look them up or just be like, figure them out by context clues and still laugh. And that was just like, you know, that wasn't an issue for me. I didn't see a show about like, oh, a Jewish guy, an old Jewish guy, what am I supposed to do with that? I'm not for me. Larry, David, and I are the same age, so I take exception to the word <laughs> old. Uh, <laughs> old Jewish guy. We're not old, Isa. Um, I, by old, I'm I meant graceful. <laughs> graceful? Yeah, he's yeah. clearly a graceful man. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> yes, we're graceful, Larry and I. Very good. Nice recovery. <laughs> <laughs> the show focuses a lot on Issa's love life. Hey. Who's your number one crush? My number one crush right now is, is Drake. Drake. Yeah, oh my God, you, you knew? Because that's my Drizzy. I <laughs> Wait, love him. Girl, I know we said that 
black women don't fight, but I'll fight you for him right and now. And I will cut you. <laughs> so, let's see. All right. <laughs> Hands no. off. Got you this. I'm a Scotto, but some shit Drake would like. <laughs> Why are you saying I like Drake? Every black girl that went to college likes Drake. He just really gets us. Are you texting Drake right now? No, no, no. <laughs> no. No, I'm not. Okay. Okay. <laughs> this is true. We all love were Drake. You, Drake he, were you texting Drake at that moment? I was, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I was, actually. I thought so. You should meet her. Yes, I actually was. Oh, my was. God. Yeah. That but is so good, Gail. I first heard about her from Larry Wilmore. Larry Wilmore said, you should know this girl. She's yeah. smart. She's talented. Who played an instrumental role in her career. Yes, and you, she and was Richard. on your show. So yes, you know, she was, and good. she's amazing. Love but the it. two of you are even more amazing. Yeah.